This is Sway. 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 In the morning. In the morning. In the morning. I'm gonna shake your body. Wake your fuck ass up. Now. Right, ladies and gentlemen, have to be. What up, though? Fuck the dumb shit. Okay. We're gonna cut through the chase. We do a lot on this show. I know, man. A lot of people come on this show. We had mad people. President Obama. Right. Valerie Jarrett. Right. They've been on this show. Kevin Harvick. NASCAR, one of the biggest drivers in NASCAR. He's been on the show. Mm. Gladys Knight was here this week. How you gonna say that? I'm Ooh. just talking legendary, Heather B. That's all. Yeah. It's only rightfully so. You have the B. You're a legend in your own right. Give Johnny it up for the B, damn thing, it. Johnny, do my thing. I ain't had to lick no helmets to get here either. Know what I mean? <laughs> ain't no motherfucking helmet licker. You ain't a helmet licker. <laughs> you know what I mean? We don't do that here on Sway in the Morning. Fuck politics. Sucking all that meat to get in the game. Yeah. <laughs> they always trying to pull the charades, pull the wool over your eyes in this rap game now. Mm. They make you think it's because of the person they affiliated with. It's political bullshit. Nah. <laughs> exactly. Sometimes they want to make you think if you got the flyer sneakers on, that make you the dopest MC. Mm. Exactly. Because you know who? You get props? It don't work like that. Nah, son. You got to put in work. You got to produce everybody from Jay Mills to Mariah Carey to Wu-Tang Clan to Styles P to Immortal Technique to Lloyd Banks to Saigon to Cool G Rap. If you want to be known as a legendary producer like my man Scram Jones is. Okay. Resume sounds crazy. <laughs> yeah. Ain't nobody weak up here, hey? Right, Scram Jones? Not at all. How you been, bro? I'm good, man. Blessed. Thank you for having me. What's been up with you, man? <laughs> Trying to get some sleep, you know, regular shit. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Just working, man. Working. Just working working we'll... hard in the studio, working in the clubs, on the radio Saturday, six to eight, as yeah. you know. There it is, man. You know? Talk that shit, man. Trying to talk that shit. I'm kind of tired, though. Okay, that's all right, man. We all tired. <laughs> we tired of the bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> Who you been working with lately? You said you've been in the studio. Yeah, uh, I discovered joints with Jada recently. Oof. Um, Oof. Oof. You Ooh. know, uh, got something with J. Cole in the works. You know, oh, my brother Dave East. Make sure you go Dave get that. Dave East, I like his you new know, project, too. A lot too. of shit, you know. What's up with Dave East flexing on the cover, though, man? Like trying to why show not? off this, you know. Why not? Pause, why not? Pause, but why not? Yeah, hey, yeah okay. Yeah. Met Dave East in East Harlem. Had the B walking on the street. We just heard a new Dave East and Nas joint last night on Shade 45. Yeah, that's, that's a what's nice up. one. Peace to Dave East, man. Did you do that one, Scram? No, I did not. Oh, do damn, that damn, dog. That's fire. Damn, I felt like he was claiming it. Uh, <laughs> no, <negative. laughs> but we, right. got, we got a bunch of joints. You brought some beats for us today? Absolutely. Okay, Scram Jones, give him a round of applause, ladies and gents. <laughs> now, I invited a good friend of mine, man, up here, man. I really enjoy this guy, man, from day one. Mm -hmm. Ain't nobody do it quite like him. He's a very unique individual which I, I can appreciate because on the fundamentals that I was brought up on, innovation and uniqueness is a key component to being great in hip-hop culture, and he's definitely created a lane for himself. Ladies and gentlemen, the one and only Jack Driller is here. Jack Driller! Yo, 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 man, I appreciate you for having me, Sway, and thank you for all those kind words, man. I can't believe you was talking about me! Yeah! <laughs> Shit, now that I said I want to take it back. Uh, <laughs> Yo, did 40 Glock really knock you out? No, that was a, that was a regular dude. That was, oh. a, and I didn't get knocked out. Oh, okay. I was already sleepy. Okay, okay. I, I I slipped and I fell back because I was overweight. I got winded. You got winded. I got winded, I mean, man. You was smothering the dude at first, man. I was whooping his ass trying to go in for the knockout, and I I I I, I ran out of gas. Yeah. I ran, it ain't like a regular fight when you're in the club and stuff. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You you really have to have stamina, technique, and and a game plan. Yeah. And I I, I forgot everything I was supposed to do. It was in training and yeah. went for what I knew. Yeah, and maybe that one punch he actually got in on you is the one that put you on your ass? And man. You could have... <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you something, dog. I woke up the next day and my jaw was hurt. And I ain't see I ain't know why it was hurting because I'm like he wasn't hurting me. Yeah. But when I saw the footage, I saw myself like I was watching myself catch a cold. Oh, it hit me. Hey. My whole face was moving over. Wow. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The punch didn't hurt when it happened though, right? No, it didn't hurt when it happened. My eyes stayed in. I closed it when I saw the impact coming uh -huh. so it wouldn't pop out. Okay. I wasn't gonna take that kind of embarrassment. Yeah. Maybe did he hit you because your left <laughs> eye is the, 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 the artificial eye, right? Yes, my okay. left eye. So did he catch you with a right hook? Uh, he caught me with all kinds of shit. 
Right. <laughs> if you if you see me fighting the bear, <laughs> help me. Okay. Don't help the bear. Help me. Okay. Help. Right. I, I will help you. Help. All right. <laughs> this is what we're going to do. Uh, Jack Thriller brought some of them seeds. We're going to meet them in mom- momentarily. But right now, I want to let Scram Jones, you know, take over for a second so we can get ready for this Friday cypher. Home of the hyenas. Hyenas. Scram Jones, it's on you. This goes out to the non-believers in the Sway in the morning, only on Shade 45.